It's 12.30 and I have just finished setting up the most epic archery hide ever. I basically climbed up this rock wall. Right here. And I hid myself behind this big, massive evergreen. Eventually that sun is going to be moving into this angle. And when it's prime time for the elk to be coming down to get water, I'm going to have my silhouette. The sun was going to completely expose me against the face of this rock, so I took some old branches that I found on the ground and pieces of wood and laid it on top of this greenery. I typically don't like to break uh, branches when I'm elk hunting because this is what happens when you break a branch. You see that white spot? That's going to be completely exposed facing the sun, and the elk are going to go, what's that about? I'm basically in their backyard, and they're going to know when something's changed. So I've laid all that down. I've got a narrow archery shooting lane right here. I've already checked out my bow. I've cleaned out the back area for my drawing space. And what our setup is, is there's a massive lake right here. And this is a wide funnel that goes down into there with nine trails. and my farthest shot should only be 35 yards. Let's close out 2018 and get this done. Elk hunting. Ah. Well, it is 8 p.m. Colorado time. We got a quarter moon behind me. Looks like we're gonna be calling this Colorado elk season to a close. Unfortunately, we weren't able to get anything in the dirt. But it's called hunting and not killing. I've learned a lot. Hope you guys enjoyed these videos. Stay tuned for the next adventure.